Deku versus Class A. I like how they use his hero name here. That's a good touch. Why are you here? Because we're worried about you. He looks so tired. Well, a smile right now. Come Bakugo on, being an asshole, us. finally being useful. Or a useful trait, I, I should say. Smile. So here's the deal. I think I said this at the end of the last episode, that Class A has very good capture quirks, actually. But more than that, if you compare them to the quirks of pros that we know of so far, Class A's quirks are legitimately some, like, really good quirks. Um, you know, Ito, of course, comes from a hero family with the super speed. Incredibly useful. Uraraka's anti-gravity is legitimately like a S-tier power, if it's used correctly. Sero, surprisingly, is... Like, I don't know if he trains his ability, does it let him just make more tape before he, like, runs out, or does it make his tape stronger? Because that is an incredibly useful ability. Even Mineta with the balls is, like, it's like a direct, it's like, um, you know, like, if you're playing a strategy game, that's a direct counter to, like, strength-based heroes, because he can just stick you together until you can't, like, do anything. It was the essence of being a true hero. Thinking about Midoriya's own words. I know very mm. well that you can't be stuck. Loner, you think the rest of us are just extras? That's how Bakugo used to think of his classmates. It's extras. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Wait, what? with Black Whip hanging out. People. Interesting. Black Whip is Black Whip is a physical thing that you can interact with. I guess I didn't think of it that way. It's, that's weird that Sarah can tape it, I think. We're getting spooked. Zero. And they all helped him train his powers Whoa! too. You, but it was more of a relief than you can imagine. Oh, Jiro. Beat this guy. And this is really good to show like he has had these amazing interactions with every single one of his classmates basically. I, I love this because I've said this since season one of this show, that it does a very good job of, like, alternating the spotlight between the various side characters. You know, Bakugo always calls them extras, and he's, like, turning that around on Midoriya now. You know, you think of us as extras, but the show has never treated them that way, and I really appreciate that in a shonen, especially, like, one with such a huge cast. It's like killing you myself. Wow, that's a wild way to think about it. All for one would and then fight along nice. you in the streets. But things have At first I thought class B class B was just gonna show up or like the robotics division, like the whole school came for him, not just this class. That would be dope. Change. We Stand down. Listen to this us. This is really not touching. A bunch of you could really use a bath! Don't make me <laughs> You could really use a bath. I didn't even get to electrocute him. Out of Ragnarok. Well, danger sense hasn't activated a single time. Oh, that's a good touch. The no danger sense. You have to stop. Heaven piercing ice wall. Oh yeah, here we go. Let's bring out the big guns. I don't push us away. Oh my god. We'll share this responsibility with You want to cry but your burden won't allow you to. That's, who's that sound like? Todoroki, the person in this class, like, who has the most reason to, like, just be destroyed, you know what I mean? That was a really good moment, like, a really good way to show how you can let your friends down, even if you think you're doing the right thing. This is unexpectedly touching from Sue. Securing the surrounding area. Are these three don't get to fight Midoriya? That's a shame. Flying around so fast. Oh yeah, if they could locate Midoriya and they'd already decided to bring him in, why didn't they send Best Genist? He's like the perfect... I guess Midoriya could just break out of his own clothing, but he might be reluctant to do that. Let's give these students a moment alone. Hmm. He thinks they can convince him, so he comes in willingly. Todoroki using his brain and his brawn here. You could all die! They could die without you there. This is a 
all for one is the type of person who would attack you away even if you're not there just to hurt you you know what i mean he's he's shown that in the past it's part of the reason why shigaraki is the one he groomed to just to hurt all might through the connection you know that's what Midoriya doesn't understand yet. He doesn't know how all for one is. You can't keep up. Oh, now he's insulted them. Oh, we're starting to bump, get him bumping here. You figured out how we could kick some butt. He shows that it's okay to be afraid, because Mineta is always kind of like a little bit cowardly. No, oh, he hesitates. They're using a ramp just like they did when they rescued Bakugo. It's just a remix of that same plan. Can you hear this song without getting a little emotional, though? The, all the moments they've used it. The voice actors are doing such an amazing job, too. Oh, they, they hit Ida in there. This is another thing I really like about the show. You know, they instantly set up Bakugo as Midoriya's main competitor, but the show is not so one note as that, right? Because Ida has also been competing with Midoriya since the beginning. He made that clear. You know, he is chasing him in the same way Bakugo has been chasing him. And I like the show doesn't forget that, right? It brings it up again here. When you don't need to. Is the essence of being a hero, Using right? his own words against him. Shima. I don't know if that's how physics works, but okay. He's too woke. But, but I'm too scared. And now he's yeah. There are a lot of people. It's because my body moved on its own. The mark of a true hero. According to all my lives, I've looked. I didn't want to accept you. Oh, the flashback to their young selves so while they're talking is really good too. Make sure you'd stay away. Reject you. Because they get so older and older. Superior. Forced to see how strong you were. What a simple we tool to frame this. Saying this out. This is this is actually way more emotional than I thought it would be, because this is the kindest that Bakugo's face has ever looked, right? He actually cares. I never thought I would feel that way about Bakugo. He actually cares about him. Doesn't change a thing, Izuku. Uh huh? I'm sorry for everything. He's stunned. You've made the right calls ever since he's at UA and everyone else. Anybody out there in need of a hero? Such a simple scene, you, but so powerful. All of you. Ah, what a relief. Mike. Good. Hi there. Huh? Medusa, what? Can you hear me? I kind of forgot that 13 existed, and the show was very careful not to show their face until now. That's it's and then just to show it like just like that. Most civilian formed gangs, they're easy enough to deal with in one swoop. That's the UA wall. We had to split up our how did they know? Like, how did these people get this info? Let's calm the vibe down. The whole it's gonna be fine. Yeah, I'm not sure why do these people know that Midoriya was coming there. I don't know. Seems like it should not. They have a info security problem at UA still. Anyways, that was a surprise. I didn't. Uh, they they just showed Thirteen's face just like that. Wasn't even necessary, but I guess maybe if that's in the comic, then the artist just wanted to show the design eventually. I don't know. That was a really emotional episode. I wasn't expecting. I was expecting it to be a little emotional, but not like that. The voice actors absolutely crush it. Like I can't. That scene could have fallen really flat because it was very static, you know? It was so simple, like with him and Bakugo still talking, but like showing their progression through their lives. Um, the look on Bakugo's face and him bowing and apologizing 
um, kind of reminds me of the scene where um, Satsuki in Kill la Kill apologizes. Uh, like this very heartfelt apology from a character that you really wouldn't have ever expected that from. I really enjoyed this episode, as you could probably tell. If this show keeps giving us more of this, like the final season, I, what I'm assuming will be the final season next season, um, will be fantastic. And we still have a couple more episodes this season too, so that is great.